Hi guys. It is an absolutely spectacularly gorgeous over the top beautiful day. Here in the collapse of everything here on this just postcard perfect day at Bugs in a Jar Farm here on it is a Tuesday. It is August 13th, 2024 and uh so, uh, instead of doing one big long rant, I'm going to do three rantlets today, kind of uh, cliff note versions of, of full-scale rant. So, <clears throat> we're going to start off uh, with a cliff notes version of a rant that I recorded last night. Well... I did not record it. My, uh, you know, my, my loud mouth, racist, evil twin, over there at that other channel we don't talk about, uh, did the full rant on this subject. And uh, since I am an eco pussy, I did not have the balls to post it, or my evil twin. Uh, grabbed it from me so you can find this full rant over there at that other channel but uh, so if you've already heard it you don't need to listen to the, the, this, this cliff notes version so anyway what it was was looking at th this new spate of articles about uh, how the world the the world is worried this uh, the Washington Post talking about how the world is worried about monkeypox and I use the term for the perfectly legitimate term for this monkeypox uh, how the world is worried about monkeypox and then an article from the Telegraph saying monkeypox can no longer be ignored and of course there were zero comments on a planet of eight billion people about uh, monkeypox uh, exploding in sub-saharan africa and, and both the articles were particularly looking at uh, the country of the democratic republic of congo and uh, the the head of the African CDC was was talking about how uh, this is a full blown crisis. We are losing the youth of Africa. The African CDC is declaring this emergency. The World Health Organization is getting in on the game, uh, convening meetings and all of this. And so then you start re not reading between the lines. It, it's breaking it down and looking at what is never being reported in, 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 in these stories. And what uh, my evil twin did, he spent five minutes of research mostly on the Democratic Republic of Congo uh, website. And, and, and here's what it comes out to is this full-blown crisis uh, in the uh, DRC killing all of these children, approximately 400 people under the age, 15 or under, have died of monkeypox. 400 uh, kids have died uh, this year of monkeypox in, uh, in the DRC. And if you left it right there, like the Washington Post did, and did not dig one quarter of an inch further, you would not have heard what five minutes of research took to find out, I guarantee goddamn you the reporter at the Washington Times, the editor and maybe the publisher even were aware of these, but if the reporter, the editor, the, and the publisher, and, and certainly the readers were not aware of this, we're going to go dig uh, about a quarter inch between the headlines and find out what 400 uh, 
people 15 and under uh, in, in the Democratic Republic of Congo means. Okay, what it means is, well, well first you have to look at the fact that uh, according to the Democratic Republic of Congo's own website, I guess, there are 54 million, 54 million kids under the age of uh, 15.8 years old. 54 million of them, 400 of them have died which means that 0.0007% of people under the age of 15 in the Democratic Republic of Congo have died of monkeypox this year, while 99, is it 99.9993% or 99.993%? I, I'm, I'm losing my math, have not died of monkeypox. <clears throat> so, uh, we have uh, 54 million uh, people uh, right now under the age of 16, uh, we'll call it in the Democratic or Republic of Congo, but in one year from now, we're going to have 58 million people under the age of 16 in the Democratic of Congo because four million people, four million new babies are hitting the ground in the Democratic Republic of Congo every single year. Every single year, which uh, wh what that translates to, if you do the math, is that it doesn't even take one hour in less than one hour of every single hour of every single day of every single year in the DRC on this planet, uh, 400 uh, new, new babies are born. The, it, it, it takes less than one hour. Okay. So listen to this rant, less than one hour from now, humans will have replenished every single uh, kid uh, th that has died in the Democratic Republic of Congo from monkeypox uh, in, in the past year. In less than one hour from now, guys. Okay, what a, a, a couple of other facts. Uh, that my evil twin picked up in five minutes. The, uh, <clears throat> the population increase for the DRC is 3.3% per year. And what that means is the birth rate right now in the DRC is every woman this year is having an average of six children in, uh, in, in their family. Six babies to every woman in the DRC. Do your math with the 54 million, which will be 58 million in one year, just entering breeding age. And you will see the population in 1970 of the DRC was 20 million. Today it is 109 million. As my evil twin says, it looks to me like nine, there are 90 million people in the DRC who never should have been born. Okay, it, it's time to cut the crap here, people, uh, about what the fucking crisis is in the DRC uh, and, and in Sub-Saharan Africa, and of course I would say the planet. It is the crisis is not uh, that three hundred that that four hundred uh, kids uh, that four hundred people under the age of sixteen uh, in a country of one hundred and nine million. 
uh, have died this year. The crisis is that 400 uh, kids will be born in the DRC uh, in less than an hour. Okay? Uh, all, all of this talk, uh, but because I, I'm, a, I'm a white man with a southern accent, you're a racist! You're a racist! It, it, it's time to cut the crap. Uh, I, I, I'll take being a racist, uh, if it means being an ecologist, the, the, the crisis in, 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 in fucking DRC, it's a basic ecological equation. All right, so I guess anybody uh, with, with a, a high school education uh, in, uh, in ecology uh, is a racist. You, you, you know, I, 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 I'm sick and tired of it uh, for anybody pointing out that what the fuck is going on in Sub-Saharan Africa uh, it, 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 we, we can't talk about it because we might offend uh, that, that woman having six kids uh, in, in the DRC. You guys do understand that the Congo rainforest is not going to exist on this planet in 30 years from now. The second biggest rainforest on this planet will be obliterated off the face of the earth. Okay, and uh, you, you, you can blame all of these honky colonialists and all of this shit. Uh, I, I ain't buying it. Uh, 10,000. Uh, th this is one sub-Saharan African country. One. We'll have 10 thousand more mouths to feed tomorrow than they did today. And, and, and if anybody does not think there is a connection between that statistic and, and what the hell is going on uh, in the UK today, uh, obviously uh, you haven't been paying attention. As that racist uh, lefty Noam Chomsky uh, was pointing out uh, about five years ago that 20 years from now, meaning 15 years from now, the, the immigration going on at the U.S. Mexican border will not, it won't be a historical footnote to what is getting ready to happen in, in, in Europe. Uh, as any one of those 10,000 kids being born today uh, in, in the Democratic Republic of Congo uh, pulls their head out of their ass and gets their black ass to Honkyville, which is exactly what I would be doing uh, if I was born uh, in, in the Democratic Republic of Congo uh, in, in the last 20 years. Cut the crap! We have a crisis in the Democratic Republic of Congo and it doesn't have a goddamn thing to do with monkey pox. Monkey pox is a little plea, plea from Mother Nature trying to save herself from this parasitic plague uh, of, of humans uh, breeding like termites. Uh, anyway, that is the Cliff Notes version of that rant which went on a little longer than uh, Cliff Notes version, but you can hear the rest of it over at that other channel that we have two more Cliff Note versions of uh, rants to do. So I'm going to shut up on this one. Bye guys.